Hi guys, today's poll is um, not only with myself, but there's two of us pouring today. Um, welcome to my channel with art, uh, with Bade Art, where you'll learn tips and tricks. Sit back and enjoy, and please don't forget to press the subscribe button if you have already. Thank you very much. Let's get on with it. Okay, we'll put that in last. So this is more of a kind of like a lesson, paint pouring lesson. And you go ahead and put whatever colours you want in. You want white, you have to do white first. So you put a little bit of white in. So this white is actually just ordinary house paint white. Don't worry if there's a bit on the board, it's fine. Okay. Go for it. Any colours, eh? Whatever colours you want. And then... <coughs> So the higher you lift it when you're pouring, the deeper the paint will sink. So if you only want it on the surface, you don't want the paint colours to mix, then um, you paint, you pour the paint closer to the top. You can also pour it uh, down the sides as well. Excuse the noisy lawnmower outside. Yeah, it always happens when you <laughs> least expecting it. There is some more black here. Oh, your colours are looking beautiful. Uh, some more yellow if you want. I'm just going to use a teeny bit of black. So don't need much paint. So you can go ahead and use all of that paint up. So we do have a little bit of silicone, probably about three drops in each colour. Yours is looking really funky, hey? Mm -hmm. Cool. Just what I so want. there's more blue, blue if you want. Just trying to figure out the colour. I mm. might use just a teeny bit more copper. I love copper. 
There's more copper here for you. If you want, you want more copper? Yes, please. It's looking really pretty. Scrape it all out if you want because um, I won't use it again. It's it's too little. I'll wait for you. Okay. But I might just flip mine over in the meantime. Yeah, you can flip now, don't worry about that, but because we're going to put the gold to cover it, I'm also going to put a little bit of white around the edges, which will allow the paint to move, so it doesn't fold over itself when you're tilting. And if you don't want to tilt the whole lot, like the whole way around, you want to mm -hmm. leave a white space, that's fine as well. Put your hand there. I'm just trying to there. Okay, okay. Oh. you got it? Yep. Okay, Foster. There we go very good so I'm not going to put white paint on yet look how beautiful that is can you guys see this that is stunning this is going to be beautiful Claudia. I'm telling you this is <laughs> I might even want to keep this myself but now I can't <laughs> oh, no, I can't but just leave it for a while we just wait until the majority of it is down that is absolutely stunning Oh, I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Let me just... Let me start this. It's so beautiful. Okay, whenever you're ready. Oh, wait, can I show you? I'm not going to lift it. So a good way of doing it is if you take the cup gently, drag it a little teeny bit while you're lifting it a little bit, and then just release it. So that it's almost like as if the air and it just releases and pushes the paint out. And then you can bring your cup to the side and let it come off. There's a hair there. You want to grab that? Oh, there we go. Yeah, so then when, when the paint releases, you can pull the cup this way, or whichever way. Don't go over the paint again, because it will make drops, which is not that pretty. Okay, so whenever you're ready, tilt, and release. Wow, I said don't go over the top. Sorry. <laughs> not sorry to me, it. it's you, it's your painting. Look how beautiful that is. I think what I'm going to do is, um, it doesn't look like you have any bubbles. Just use artist breath. <laughs> Blow it and then it all, the bubbles will come out. Oh, look at this. Mm -hmm. It's like psychedelic. So cool, okay. <clears throat> right, so, if you want to start tilting, you just do it really slowly. Because I don't know, do you want... Um, look at how beautiful these are look at all these cells coming up so the more you tilt it and the more it moves around the bigger the cells will stretch out and sometimes it doesn't look very nice but you know you have a lot of paint here so I can put like a little bit of white on so that you could have something for it to run with to move with or I'll put white on and then you can have a negative space or you can just I'll put white on and you can just pour you know let it tilt it off yeah or tilt it to the sides which what would you like to do I think I'll do that huh 
think I'll do that at DIY. You want to tilt it? Yeah. Okay, <coughs> we'll start tilting it and then just a little bit and do it equally like this. So it doesn't all go to one side, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. That is so pretty. And then go, yeah, and sort of maneuver around in circles so you're not losing much. Don't go too fast. It's pretty as well. Um, <coughs> I'll put a teeny bit of white on. You want to put it down? So that should help it move. Uh, I actually need to be able to do the cup, I think. It's okay if there's other colours there because you're just going to pour it off. Do you know what I mean? Uh -huh. move that around a bit. So you see the paint is already moving with the white. Okay, hit it. Do whatever you want to do. Don't do that with this one, just move the paint, tilt and it will move with the paint. Do you know what I mean? Uh -huh. That'll move it along a little bit better. Yeah, a little bit more that way, otherwise you'll even lose a lot here. So you've got to watch all around, <laughs> kind of have eyes everywhere. And you can tilt off the sides that you don't like. Like if you wanted to keep more of this side, you can tilt more of this side off. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> Yeah, for mine. Oh, look at that. Uh, and I'm probably out of shot. But that's okay. No, you stay where you are. If it doesn't want to move, you can just pull it gently like that with your finger over the edges. Like, because you can pull the paint. nice if I knew somebody close you know who lived nearby who collects skins because you know sometimes I look at these skins and I think oh they're so beautiful what a waste you know people make jewelry with it wow that's so pretty So this is mine. Um, hands over the table, please. I just, you know, this papa really gives such a great effect. I really enjoy using it. Look at that. So pretty. Look at this here. That's really pretty. Yours is gorgeous. Now, just have a look around the edges. You see here some blank white canvas. And there's some more there. And then what you do is you take your finger like this. Just to maintain. Or you can, you can do it like this. And you see the whole thing is on your finger picture is still on your finger
I can draw two of those actually cells. Oh what? Cells. Cells. Yeah. And now the cells won't make the canvas come through. Well if it's yeah. not yeah. if it doesn't yeah, those are cells, but have a look at the side. These canvas. But I'm going to give you cups. And you can put it on the cups and then you'll be able to see better. So if you can lift it gently. And then you try and balance it evenly. I don't know if that's in the right place. Put it down. And I can try and balance it. Yep. How's that side? Yep. Is it balanced properly? Like yep. in this one here? I don't know. Okay. Wow, mine's very um <laughs> light colours. Did you go around all the edges? Because I see these little bits of canvas sticking out here and there. Oh, I'm just going to use my finger. Okay. So cool. Yeah. Beautiful. That's awesome. Mm? I like it. You happy with that? Yep. That's good. Okay, guys, I'm going to bring you down from there and show you. That's so cool. Yeah. Really That's cool. awesome. Mm? I like it. You happy with that? Yep. That's good. Okay, guys, I'm going to bring you down from there and show you. that curtain now. Might be able to see better. So this is Claudia's no 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 sorry. Um this is Claudia's one. Claudia can you close the curtain again please? Thanks. Super beautiful. I love this part because this part reminds me kind of like coral. I think the whole thing reminds me of coral. Oh. With the colours and everything. But you don't really like get to see it yes. in, in its natural environment. Look at that there. Cells within cells. And look at that. How beautiful is that? Wow. This is impressive. And this is her second paw. It is stunning. I just love the way all the colours have come together as well. Wow. <laughs> it actually looks like you've got these... Look at that. It looks like a water bubble. Mm -hmm. That's phenomenal. Absolutely stunning. I'll show you my little sad one. Not as impressive. I only used, um, I think, about three colours. beautiful though, I like it. Just not as much going on as her one. I think if you guys haven't tried the copper before, it's really worth giving it a go. Well guys, thank you very much for joining us and watching again. Please don't forget to hit the like and subscribe. It really helps me out quite a bit. 
and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.